Hi, my name is Melissa Brown Bitterman, and my flow hive is in Granada Hills, California, in the San Fernando Valley. And uh, I'm a potter by vocation, and I guess avocation. I've always been interested in bees because Melissa, as you know, means honeybee. She was the Greek goddess of bees. And so there was always sort of a fascination, you know, because of that. But when we moved here to Granada Hills, my husband and I, almost 30 years ago probably, there were a lot of bees in the neighborhood. And we had this nice piece of property with orange trees, 100-year-old orange trees. And we thought, wouldn't it be fun to be, to keep bees? We were gardeners and, you know, it's natural extension. You need the pollinators. They're important. So that's how we started. Here we are again, you know, much later. You know, we're, you know, in our 50s and beekeeping is a strenuous activity. You know, my husband used to lift, you know, full supers of honey and from the back of the yard. And it's just, it's heavy, hot work. And I just didn't know if I was gonna be able to convince him. But then I found the flow hive. <laughs> <laughs> Honey, <laughs> come and see this. You have to see this, because I think this is a missing piece. And, he's, and he said, I, I agree. We need it. Let's do it. So I was one of the first people to buy a flow hive that first day, the first hours it was available. I set my alarm so I could <laughs> make sure that I was in on the first wave. We've had the flow hive, oh, about two months now, I guess. And we bought a nuke and hived it about two months ago. The brood was filled out in the nuke pretty well initially. We put the second box on. Oh, we've got some honey. Through Flow Hive, I've learned about foundationless frames, which I'm really excited about, and it's worked out really well. We've had the flow frame on for about a week, and this morning when I opened the observation window, I could see their little tongues, and they're starting to bridge the gap um, in the flow frame, in the, the cells. And so they're getting close. They'll be, I think they're going to start filling it within the next week or so. I'm really excited. It almost feels like a partnership. And keeping seems an odd phrase, even, because I give them what they need. They enhance my world with pollination and honey and everything that they bring. Watching them and, you know, feeling that piece of, yeah, the honor of being able to just observe them. It's really enhanced my life. We had a credo when we first moved in here to only plant things that either fed other things or fed us. You know, we have enough to feed the whole neighborhood and honey too now because of Flow Hive. How cool was that? We've got lots of sweet stories coming up each week, so if you want to be up to date, hit the subscribe button below.